quickly, I want to say that um, I tried making, well, I did make a video on Sunday and I did put it up, but I had um, put a song in it and YouTube basically bitch slapped me and told me that I couldn't use that song. So whatever, I did not end up redoing the video because I didn't have it saved. I had it in its final formation, just not saved in iMovie to redo it, like take out the song and put in a new one in any way. The content in it was um, specifically mashed up with the song, so did not end up redoing that or making another video, obviously. So I'm doing this now because uh, I saw the Drunken Hippies video about uh, clothes and how one's perception of things can make one not wear clothes. Uh, that didn't come out right, but I mean, uh, in her particular video, she was talking about um, a pair of pants that she has fit into that were in her skinny bunch, skinny pants. And um, she actually wore them. And then the next time she went to put them on, she didn't because she felt that they were too small. And um, I know that the brain doesn't catch up sometimes because I have a pair of size 12 pants that I fit into but every time I look at them I think oh they're too small I don't want to wear them but they do fit me it's just that my brain hasn't caught up yet I just look at them and I think well it's obvious that I'll never fit in or that I don't fit into those because they're, they just look too small um, but there's also another factor in it where um, I feel more comfortable in bigger clothes because my body is hidden, I guess. And um, I f I'm at this point in my weight loss, I guess, where um, clothes just fit me really awkwardly right now because um, I'm losing weight in places that don't match up to other places, if you know what I mean. Um, so, my body just looks really awkward to me right now. Um, but I did have a couple of good moments the other day. Um, I had looked in the mirror and actually seen some things that I liked, and I actually when I was taking a shower after um, exercising, I was standing straight as an arrow and I looked down and I saw s parts of my toes and that was really exciting to me because I do not remember the last time that I could actually say that I had looked down and saw my feet in any shape, way, or form because um, I have always had this incredibly huge gut. so. That's why I'm on gut to cut because I need to get rid of my gut. <laughs> um, it has always been the part that I have hated the most. Um, I have two stomachs and I don't need two. I'm not a camel or a cow. So, um, not storing extra stuff there. Well, I am, obviously, because if I wasn't. But anyway. You know what I mean. Um, so I have clothes that fit me too big and I have clothes that fit me too tight and um, it's just a nightmare because I actually felt better about myself when I had lost 40 pounds and now I just feel really awkward in clothing. I feel like clothing doesn't fit my body the right way. And um, the things that I do feel comfortable in are really too big for me and hide me. And that's just going back to the way I used to dress before. Although not really because I, I really looked like a bum before. I mean, I have pictures from Spain where I'm wearing like really ratty sweaters 
and I look like a hobo, so. But, and also there were a lot of pictures of me on Facebook wearing um, clothing with holes in them, and, and it was really disgusting, and I don't know how I ever let myself be in pictures at that point in my life. But, anyway. So, I just, I'm in this weird thing, I guess, where I feel like clothes that actually fit me and that show off my figure make me feel fat. Whereas clothes that are entirely too big um, either make me feel like I look fatter or they hide me so I feel more comfortable. And I tend to not want to focus on how I look. And I have been avoiding looking in the mirror a lot lately, so. But sometimes I force myself to just so that I can um, get accustomed to looking at myself and picking out things that I do like rather than being overly harsh and critique myself in a way that makes myself feel like crap. So, but anyway, uh, I also wanted to say that I had unofficially weighed myself uh, last Saturday and was up six pounds and was incredibly frustrated because I had worked out five times that week even though I did have takeout every day as per my really upset video that everybody made me feel so great after because a lot of people commented and made me feel better but um so yeah exercise five times gained six pounds really frustrating um, I I feel like I work really hard I push myself every time I work out and to gain six pounds um, it was really like a slap in the face but I could never I really could never explain my body and I never will I just know that I'm never gonna lose a lot of weight in a week um, and then I'm gonna lose it very 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 slowly so realistically in the next eight months I'm probably only gonna lose 28 pounds and that kind of stinks but anyway um yes what was I going to say oh uh, so I gained six pounds on the Saturday I weighed in at Weight Watchers and was up a pound which means that I unofficially lost five there was a weird noise in the kitchen probably my cat playing around with things so anyway I am running out of time and this is pretty long damn it I didn't want it to be this long so I'm sorry um, but yeah anyway if this is happening to you and you have some advice about it or if you just want to commiserate <laughs> uh, you know what to do anyway